Indian Ambassador to Laos C. Guru Raj Rao, Friday, the 15th of August, hosted the flag hoisting ceremony in Vientiane capital to celebrate her 68th year of independence. The gathering attended by dozens of senior officials of Laos and India, foreign diplomatic officials and Indian expatriates in Laos. According to the Indian ambassador to Laos, my thoughts turned first towards the father of our nation, Mahatma Gandhi, who shaped our liberation struggle and the martyrs who made supreme sacrifice for the freedom of our country and great patriots whose relentless struggle liberated our motherland from the colonial rule of nearly 200 years. This achievement has given us an opportunity to take up the challenge of governance by reforming the policies, practices, and systems of governance. Ambassador C. Gururaj Rao said that Gandhi sought freedom from both foreign rules as well as the indigenous social chains that had imprisoned our society for long. I would like to wish all Indian nationals and persons of Indian origin who are living in Laos People's Democratic Republic, as well as all our friends of India in Laos, a very warm and happy Independence Day of India. After long years of non-violent and peaceful struggle under the leadership of Mahatma Gandhi, India attained independence. Laos and India established diplomatic relations on 2nd February 1956. Since 1997, Laos and India has implemented the increased comprehensive cooperative policy to strengthen their friendship relation by exchange of regular visits of different level high-ranking delegations and support to each other in the regional and international stages. To bring our two countries much closer than what they were to before my coming here. We held foreign office consultations. We held joint commission meetings to identify various new areas of cooperation and we implemented uh, many projects which will bring our people closer. In the beginning of the year 2000, the India has offered a number of assistance to Laos, including the assistance in the field of human resource development, agricultural and irrigation development, science and technology, IT, defense, Wat Pu Champasak renovation project, soft loan for economic infrastructure development, and UXO.